Okay, this may be two of the stupidest ideas I've ever come up with, but I'm gonna see how it works out. Tired of lifting these big heavy uh, units and trying to stack them in the transmission, 10 or 80 being one of them. So I'm gonna try to stack this drum in the tranny. Uh, I don't know how well this is gonna go, plus this camera mount. I got it mounted right to the tranny. Um, I don't know how that's gonna work out either, but we're gonna give this a shot. Um, I already got, let's see if I can see in here properly. I already got the output shaft in and the bearing that goes on it. Oh, one of the other things I was gonna talk about, to talk about these laser markings on this drum. This is the first one I've had come in that's actually had had the markings on it. It's got it here and it's got it right there. Now they say they're supposed to line up. They don't line up. It either will be right here or be over here if you try to move it. Mine was right here when it came in. That's where I'm going to leave it. I don't want no vibrations. So put the drum in. Got this drum. Need to put the bearing on the back of it. Okay. We have our sun gear side up our planetary drum assembly. This is where it may be getting kind of fun. Camera may be right in the way too. Surely that's not down. Don't think that can be down. Well, let's see. And Maybe it is. We got the bearing on the back of our planet. Another sun gear. Oh, 
and the assembly. Okay, we are definitely not down. So Let me see if I can do something here. Laying this on its side. Easier with this camera anyway.
Okay, let's try that. Okay, it looks like it went down. Put our snap ring in. So it can be done. It is a little bit of work, but not quite as tough as trying to pick that whole damn thing up. And you don't have to get two people to do it. Put your bearing on your planet. bearing on the front side here. Put the lock ring on. Turn it in the spot and put the lock on. All right, so it can be done. See you on the next one.